Hey, Lazy Girl Approved fam, I am back today with another wig review and I am about to do a curly series. Um, I was going to do them all in one video, but I think it's just better to have them separate. However, the point of doing them is to help you decide out of the curly wigs that are out right now. These aren't all brand new, but they're new er, new ish to decide which one you want. It's three different ones and one of them is two of, two of the same style in different colors. However, I'm going to do them separately, but I will post them, you know, within a day or two of each other. So we are going to start with the first one in the series, which is, it is Outre Priscilla. And it is a wet and wavy style, 20 inches, and the color is DRFF Honey Brown. Um, let's look up her information right quick. Okay, so here she is, and there's, like I always say, check in Google the shopping tab to see where you can get her for the best price. Um, I can't remember where I got her from, but we're going to go with wig types because that's my favorite site. And why is it my favorite site? Because they are, they ship on time. So they ship, what is it? They literally tell you, yeah, 5 PM Eastern daylight savings time. Um, and they tell you how many hours left, um, for you to get it same day. Um, so, and they always get it out the same day, and then it usually comes within two days. Never had any issues with something being shipped that shouldn't, something not being shipped that should, no damage, nothing. And they usually have the best prices. They don't have usually sales. Like it will say, you know, 45% off, but that's reflected in the price. So it's not a coupon on top of it. It's just that they have low prices. So. Um, this is Priscilla here, and let's see if they have a picture of, what did I say it, it is? Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness, DRFF Honey Brown. So that's the color it's showing. Let me see. Nope, that's Chocolate Swirl. Yeah, so they don't have a picture of the DRF, DRFF Honey Brown. That one's beautiful, too. Um, but that's what she's looking like. And I promise, and I, I don't want to butcher, butcher your name, Draca, 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 however you say it, Draca Fine, I promise you I won't brush this wet and wavy one out. I promise. I learned my lesson. There is no way to unbrush it. <laughs> Uh, okay, so wet and wavy style, 20 inches, HD transparent lace, natural baby hair, pre-plucked lace parting, high, high text, <laughs> high heat resistant fiber safe up to 400 degrees. And there she is there. So let us get her out of the package and see what she looks like in real life. Yes, this is the card. This is the other side of the card. That red looks gorgeous. The cinnamon spice. It looks more red, but then when I look at it, it's kind of like orange. I think that's, yeah, that's her there. So it's very pretty. Not usually a color, though, that looks good on me. So here's what she's looking like. Super pretty curl, super pretty. All right, two combs in the front and it's got the ear to ear lace and one comb in the back and the elastic, <laughs> um, <laughs> elastic adjusters. I've been recording, it is, what time is it? 6 p.m. I've been recording with just two breaks, like one for lunch um since 10 10 oh, 30 after i got back from the post office a girl is tired but i have a backlog like you wouldn't believe because of moving it's just and it took longer to get everything unpacked because we had just a crap ton of stuff from storage and it took up more space than we thought 
it's a whole thing. I'm leaving the lace on for now until I see if I like her. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. I, you guys, okay, I love this curl. This is the curl that I used to get permed in my hair, a spiral. Like literally, I used to go in with pictures like this and say, this is what I want. Because my hair was like wavy, but not curly. It was like messy, wavy, and it was such a pain in the butt. So this is what, this this is crazy. <laughs> this is what my perm looked like. My husband would probably be like, whoa, my hair is super dark, but back in the day, this will age me. And some of you will know what this is and some of you will not, but. My hair is almost black naturally, but I used to spray sun in in it. It is a spray for those of you that don't know. And for those of you who do know, say something in the comments so I won't feel so old by myself. Um, it is a spray that's that lightens your hair naturally by the sun. I don't, I'm pretty sure it had like lemon in it or something. I don't even remember exactly how it worked, but... That's back in the day when we used to put baby oil on and lay out to um, get a tan um, and put sun in in our hair. So this is what we did. <laughs> Boy, times, yeah, have changed. Uh, she is gorgeous. This color is gorgeous. This looks like my natural hair and I put sun in, in it <laughs> or my permed natural hair with sun in it so sun in it, in it, in it. i'm not gonna do a dang thing to her except cut the lace off so let me do that i'm not gonna brush her for sure she doesn't even need coconut oil or anything she looks perfect just like this she doesn't look waxy like some of the wet and wavies i mean she is a little waxy but it's like just it's it's the wet look the other one that I brushed the other day was like super waxy. So anyways, let me cut this lace off. <laughs> you guys have no idea like what emotions I'm feeling right now. It's like I'm in high school in my early 20s. Oh, man. If only I knew then what I know now. Let me tell you what. All right. And I'm going to see if I can find a picture of me with hair like this. It wasn't, we didn't, again, I'm old. There was not digital pictures back then. So I have to see if I can find a literal <laughs> picture. Oh my gosh, I feel old. Okay, so there are some baby hairs. They're pretty sparse, like they're not thick. Um, and they're a little curly. Um, I am going to tuck those because I don't utilize baby hairs. She's so cute. I can't take it. I cannot take it. Okay. Let's test her big head friendliness. She's pretty big head friendly. She comes under my eyebrows and she's got plenty of room in here and plenty of stretch. Like there's, it's definitely roomy in here. So there's that. That's good. Um, the hairline is dumb thick, but I mean, if you've got thick curly hair, maybe I'm trying to remember my hairline when I had a perm. Um, it is the HD lace, the parting space is pretty tight in there. Um, it look, I mean, it doesn't look bad though. I feel like it doesn't look that bad. It probably could use some powder. The only problem when it's a tight parting space and you put powder is then it looks weird sometimes. Like it looks way more obvious than if you didn't put powder. So for me, for this, I would probably just leave it as is because this is wider right here. So, you know, there's that. <laughs> I just, y'all, y'all, I can't even. 
she's so cute. I didn't think I I was gonna like her. Like like I thought she was cute, but I just yeah. I'm having a moment, you guys. I hated high school, but I liked being young and able to make dumb decisions and do crazy stuff. Now my body. <laughs> betrays me and I can't like I used to jump off cliffs there was a cliff in San Diego it was called the clam I don't even know how many feet it is it's illegal to jump off it now like they literally made a law rightly so because people have died I used to climb on that the cliff and the rocks and just do crazy stuff and jump off of there and I'm afraid of heights so you know, that was crazy that I did that, but I used to just do all sorts of stuff, especially growing up in San Diego, just active. And I played soccer for 12 years and I played football. I played volleyball. I played basketball. Now I, yeah. So I digress. <laughs> Let's get a 360 of this girl. Okay, guys, so I had to go look these pictures up so I could show you. So this is what my hair looked like without a perm. It was like unruly. I would put mousse in it and it would still look like this over here in like 20 minutes. So this is why I went and got a, an actual perm like this to get some definition because it just wouldn't stay like that. So let's let's look at the other ones so this is that's probably like when my perm was going out and maybe you guys don't care about any of this but I'm just you're walking down memory lane with me okay this is it's precisely so I had cut it off and done the huge bangs I don't know if y'all can even see that uh, let's see nope pixelated because this is a picture of a picture uh, but you see the whole, you know, put baby oil on the legs and I played soccer, but I would get like a totally uneven tan from wearing shin guards and whatnot. So I would lay out to try to get it even. And then here's another one. That is probably midway through a perm. And there's. Probably perm was, oh, that's another midway one. I don't think I have any pictures of like right when I got it permed, which is crazy. Oh, this one. Hold, please. That one's pretty permy. So it's not exactly the same. And I would do my bangs, you know, and part it a little differently. But, you know, it's, you know, you get the idea. I'm just tripping. Look at it. Look at Dawn. <laughs> Look at baby Dawn. <laughs> that was when I was 17, maybe 16. Baby Dawn. Baby Dawn <laughs> with a perm. So enough of that. <laughs> Let's get back to what you care about, which is this wig. So that was the 360. I think she's super cute. She'd be cute if you just, you know, shifted her a little bit. She is a center part. Um, let me, I don't think I looked at the ear tabs to see how those line up. Did I? So they line up a little bit above where they should on me. So if you have a larger head, they might be a little short. I will probably make it a side part. Um, just shift it over and just let my hair hang out or something I don't know 
uh i love her technically she is lazy girl approved like all i did was cut the lace off and i feel like you this literally doesn't require brushing doesn't require i don't want to put like coconut oil in it because it has the perfect wet and wavy look um the colors i love these colors like i said i feel like it's like natural hair with some highlights or bleach you know bleached a bit or sun end <laughs> so um how much did i say this lady was I think she was 40 something hello hello thank you um i said yeah she's 32 to 51 so definitely <laughs> if you're gonna go get her go um take a look at which site has the best price on the color you want that's usually where the variance is is the colors so um let me know what you guys think of this i am in love and i'm gonna have some flashback memories with this girl maybe i'll walk in the house and <laughs> record my husband's reaction he's gonna be like whoa because uh, i did have this hair i think until i got pregnant which was all at 19 and then i couldn't get it permed again and then i think i got it again after i got you know, after I had the baby, had our son, um, maybe once or twice more. So until my mid twenties, maybe even early thirty, I can't remember y'all. I know for sure when my son was a baby, I got a perm because I remember the pictures of him yanking on my hair and it was curly. So <laughs> I digress and this has nothing to do with this wig as far as you guys figuring out if you want to purchase it. So <laughs> let me know what you think of it um it is big head friendly ish um it is it's soft it's textured and it's you know a little crunchy because it's wet and wavy but it's soft um affordable the color i mean it'd probably be amazing in every color i feel like um that one on the cover i think would be gorgeous so let me know what you think. And as always, thanks for hanging out and spending time with me. Look for the next curly wig review. It is going to be Denver. Your girl, Denver. So let's see if I like that one as much. <laughs> thanks, guys. Bye.